pushed in front of a subway train, and the man accused of pushing him is now talking to police. Eyewitness News reporter Anthony Johnson live outside the Midtown North Precinct with what that man is saying. Anthony, what's the latest? Well, the latest this afternoon, he's still being questioned inside of the Midtown North Precinct. They're planning on bringing in witnesses sometime this afternoon who'll go through a police lineup. But we do know the suspect has been very, very vocal. The suspect is apparently talking and giving cops details about the crime. He has reportedly told investigators about the argument which led up to the shoving match. The 30-year-old man being questioned has also stated that he stood there and waited on the platform as the Q train roared into the station and watched as the train crushed 58-year-old Kisa Khan. The suspect's whereabouts were seen on surveillance cameras near the 49th Street subway station. He was talking to vendors on 50th Street where he worked odd jobs. Detectives went to the location and took the suspect without a struggle. One vendor had recognized the suspect from media pictures and realized that he had shaved off his beard and short dreadlocks. They even recognized his voice from the argument he was having with Han before Han was violently pushed onto the tracks. The suspect does have eight prior arrests, including a burglary charge in Pennsylvania. He was actually due in court here today in New York, charged with sleeping on a park bench. He also has another open case for smoking pot in public. Now he faces the possibility of being charged with murder and one of the most gruesome and cold-hearted crimes in recent years. Now witnesses have identified the suspect as 30-year-old Naheem Davis. The media is gathered out here on 54th Street. They are waiting for him to be removed out of the precinct. Once that is done, we expect that he will be going down to court to hear the formal charges. That is the latest live from Midtown. Anthony Johnson, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.